Hey y'all, how's everyone doing? Well, I am running out the door. I didn't get my nails done, which is these. Y'all, I love Color Street. This is the French nail one, and I will do a tutorial. It just puts French tips on, then you cover it with another, and it's so easy. If you don't choose the French white, and you just choose a color, then it's just straight over the nail. It's like, it almost feels like a sticker, only it's being a polish. It's so easy, and it makes my nails grow longer. Of course, they never stay long because they split. That's just part of getting older. But anyway, so I haven't done that yet. I did get this really cool top from Stitch Fix that I wanted to show y'all. Look how pretty how it's got these little meshes, mesh um, lines in between. So it kind of makes it look a little fancier. Uh, if y'all are interested in my Stitch Fix um, clothings that I get, the hauls that I do, because um, I also just started one called um, The Look or something like that. So I was going to do unboxings of both of those if you're interested. So comment below if you're interested in those. But today, I've become a Brahmin girl, it seems. So I'm going to start with the fact that they are still only using... Um, an outer cardboard box and then when you open it it's just a piece of uh, brown paper wrap with their sticker you know of their wind jammer on it and then once you get inside it's they're just wrapped like these probably like they, how they come in the warehouse and I think the reason they're doing that is probably trying to be more conscientious about packaging and let's face it y'all it's cheaper they don't have to do all that outer stuff so and honestly it does take away from the unboxing experience but not that much. I mean, I don't really care. So, let's just get right into it. Instead of showing you the bag, I'm going to show you what goes in the bag first. Um, this is a style of bag that I haven't gotten before. Um, and because I only have one other all-white bag, well, two. I've got a small, remember the Ferragamo small one I've unboxed that recently. But it's very small. Like, you can barely carry a few things in it. Uh, which is fine if that's all I need. But if I need more space, my only other white uh, bag is my Michael Kors, and it's got silver um, hardware, and I wanted a gold hardware one. So this is called, what's it called? Shell White, and this, of course, is in the Melbourne style. That's the little alligator. Um, and this um, piece, which is a makeup pouch, is called the Danny, D-A-N-Y. And it was $95. Now, why would why would you pay that much? Because really, you could double this as a clutch. I mean, you really could just make it a clutch. And, um, and I know I will be keeping this, y'all, because even if I don't like the handbag, I definitely do need the makeup pouch for my other bag. So, because I literally could use it as an organizer. Ooh, always remember when these happen. You get a pair of scissors and you cut it over the trash can. Never leave these intact because intact, if somebody, child or animal swallowed that, it would kill them. Okay? That's what keeps moisture out of all the leather and gets it here and everything, but it also will sop up all the moisture in your stomach and intestines and kill you. So, as you can see inside, I'm just kind of bowing it together so you can see. It's got a little pocket right here, so you could put your credit cards in there and carry this as a clutch. And that's what I love about it. So, I'm probably going to actually leave the plastic on this for now. I don't know. I, oh, you know I say that, and then I get all excited. I want to take it off. But anyway, love that. It's got a good, very good zipper. Again, it's the gold hardware. It's just got the Brahmin name, not the Windjammer picture, but that's okay. That's a simple piece. Okay, where's the other little piece, though? What did I do with it? Oh, here it is. I got two pieces because I used to do full wallets, and the thing is, is I don't use a checkbook anymore, and a lot of times I just switch over cards, maybe some cash. Um, you know, if I change my mind, I might not do that anymore, but I just got a card case to match this time um, because it also does have a pretty good, let me show you this, pretty good little opening here on the side to put in cash, and that does help, Or and I also put safety pins in there. But obviously my ID, my, my uh, insurance card, and my health care cards and then on the side, I put, you know, a credit card or two. Hold on, let me get this little guy out of here. And that's just the, you know, the little registration and how to care for it thing. Uh, this is called the Cheryl. That's the style, which is um, 
or actually the name of the card case is a Cheryl, spelled C-H-E-R-Y-L, and it's in the shell white, Melbourne. Melbourne, again, means this alligator finish, and it's genuine leather, and this was $65, and I know that I will keep this as well. If nothing else, I might use this in my, um, in my Ferragamo as well, because it's just a little purse, so this would be a perfect wallet for that little purse. There's also a little thing in there that I guess you could make that, what I just cut that off from. It's got a little um, satin loop. It's not a leather loop, but you could keep your key in here if you wanted to. So that's that. So I know y'all are going, Beth, get to the purse. <laughs> I know. No, actually, I think you enjoy these little small leather goods, or SLGs, as they're called in the industry. So let's just go ahead and pull the plastic off. And I always cut the plastic. So y'all know, I don't know why. I think it's because I saw a thing about sea turtles or seals or something getting caught in trash because California dumps their trash in the um, ocean along with landfills. And so um, they were getting it caught on their nose and stuff. So I always take a pair of scissors and cut out the corner, cut all the way to the corner so right now so I don't forget. Just open that bag up where it's just a sheet. And even so, I cut the sheet in half so it doesn't take up so much space. It's just less likely if a child, an animal, or if this did get out of the landfill or whatever, it's less likely, likely to suffocate. So, here is the bag. This is called a Finley, I believe. Yes, this is a small Finley. Let me stand up and show you. This is like a perfect size. And I really also like the structured style of this. I really do. So it does have the Windjammer charm on it. It does have the pocket on the back for your cell phone. Uh, let's just go ahead and take these off. It's got rolled handles, which we all love rolled handles. Why do people love rolled handles instead of flat? I do have a couple of handbags, my very first ever Louis Vuitton that my husband got off eBay for me, which is my favorite because he gave it to me. Um, it has flat handles, and I always wish it was rolled just because it holds better, and frankly, it looks more finished. I think it looks nicer. I always hold things up to my face so y'all can see the, um, the size. Also, the thing about this, see, I'm wearing white. This shell white has a uh, pearlized finish, so, but it's a yellow pearlized finish, so it has a warm, warmth to it, and that's why I do like it with the, um, the gold hardware. Hold on, let me see if I can get this off when they do it to where you can't peel it. It's not peeling mealy. Oh, well, I'll do that later. Y'all want to see the bag. Okay, so this bag was $365. I think that is a good deal for this bag, for really for any Brahmin. They're usually between two and $300, but when they're specialty, like they have a special finish, I don't know if y'all can see, I'm going to turn it different angles so y'all can kind of see the shimmer. It has a little bit of a um, opal to the gold shimmer you know some go pink some go blue this is going gold okay but and some may say well that's that makes it less cool tone like a white is a cool tone not all whites are cool tones some of them are you know warm tone whites a little creamier and i feel like this will make this more usable if you will you know because it can go cool or it could go warm and it's really meant to go warm if it's got uh, warm hardware or gold hardware on it. There's some more of these little guys. Remember, I keep them on my desk until I can get over there and cut it over the trash can. Came with its um, dust bag. Came with a long shoulder strap, which I do always keep. Sometimes I keep them in the bag if I just don't want. There's another one of these. Um, if I don't want to fool with it. Um, you know, because sometimes I like it, sometimes I don't. Inside, I will show you, it has two pockets on one side along with what is known as the jewelry pouch. I put my car key fob in there. So my husband always knows where it is. I always tell him on a, on a Brahmin, it's always in the jewelry pouch. Anywhere else, it's just a regular zipper, which this does have a zipper pouch on the other side. And it also does have one big, large pocket for cell phone. And look at this. I got from Flaunt a white leather cell phone cover, which but which you can put the cell phone out here, but I mean, that's so perfect. I'm, I'm probably just going to put it in there. Or, you know what? I think I will put it out here um, because I'm going to use that little place. Now, this is a little bit larger, so it may take going in there a few times to fit down good. 
it fits in there just fine. I like to leave it up just a little so I can grab it easier. But this is actually where I'm going to put in this big pocket right there. And you could drop the cell phone down in it, but I'm going to drop that little. Um, and you could put the cell phone either these pockets. They're wide enough. I just wanted to put that little card case in there. And then also, I may put more privacy things in here. Uh, but it's got two huge compartments. And again, this big, long, it's almost the length of the bag, y'all, zipper. This is a great bag. Again, this is called the Finley. And I think I may, if I get another Brahmin anytime soon, I may do it in the same style. That's how much I like this, y'all. So tell me what y'all think. Again, I'm going to put this. And one of the sizes this will be my makeup and other um, pouch. When I say and other, I have so many things, honestly, that I keep in my purse now. It's not just makeup. It may be fingernail file and, you know, measuring tape or whatever. Just any way to make it easy to get it in and out quickly. Um, and I'm going to go ahead. I've got time. And hook this on. Remember when you hook on, always use the hooks provided on the bag. Don't ever hook here because it will start ripping that. That is not made. The, by the way, these are so weird the way they stick out. It, 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 the weight of it will bring that down but because it's all new. But see this piece right here? People hook to that. Don't. That's why they put that on there because inside they've reinforced it so that you will not um, tear that from the weight of the bag being in the wrong place that's not enforced. And there you go. So that's what that will look like. Again, it's adjustable. It has the little adjustable piece on it. And I will link it below if y'all are interested. Tell me what you think of the Finley, the Brahmin Finley. And I'll talk to y'all again soon. Bye!